Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel and today I'm doing a reaction video to America's Got Talent AGT audition. This is Marlene Langan. Hope I'm saying that right. And her audition. Let's check this out. <clears throat> Here we go. <laughs> My name is Maureen Langan. I live in Manhattan, mm -hmm. but I grew up in Lake Hiawatha, New Jersey, where there is no lake. Mm -hmm. So, what is your talent? What will you be doing for us today? I am a stand-up comedian. Mm -hmm. What got you into comedy? Well, I say a gift from God, but really, um... <laughs> it's, it's you, you grew up in a big Irish Catholic family with five siblings. You're always taking the crap out of each other, and it's just part of a natural wit. I think. You'll see. <laughs> Okay, the stage is yours. Have fun. Thank you. And hopefully we have some fun with you. <laughs> I don't want to hate people. They make me hate them. <laughs> I'm all about love. You feel that immediately with me. But I was on the airplane coming here. A woman in the seat behind me, she gets up and she starts spritzing cinnamon. I go, lady, what are you doing? She goes, well, it's natural. I go, so is my butt, but I'm not putting it in your face. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to hate her. She made me hate her. Do you see what's happening there? Mm -hmm. I'm a victim. I had a car accident recently. I'm all right. Don't worry. Young guy, stoned out of his mind, on his cell phone, music blaring, looked a lot like you. <laughs> Gets out of his car, you know, with the man bun? Dude, I don't know what happened, dude. I'm like, oh, what happened is in 1999, your mother forgot her birth control. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I didn't want to say that. He made me say it. I was a victim. I was victimized. Okay, so truth be told, I am at that age post-period pre-death. That's, that's my age range. Here it is. I don't want to be a cougar. Absolutely not. I don't need some young hot guy named Chad <laughs> touching my belly fat going, ooh, what's this? <laughs> what's this? This is rage. Rage. Covered by affordable treats and wine from Trader Joe's. That's what this is. <laughs> <laughs> Six years old. Where I am the hottest thing between him and death. <laughs> I can't believe he got me because he knows he'll never get anyone better to the day he dies. <laughs> and he's not looking over his shoulder for somebody younger and hotter. You know why? He has arthritis in his neck. He can't move his neck. <laughs> and he sees none of my flaws. He sees no cellulite, belly fat, varicose veins. Why? Cataracts. <laughs> Oh, that was great. That was great. Very funny. <laughs> Thank you. That means a lot, you guys. Thank you so much. You're funny, Maureen. <laughs> it's the timing. You just have this really good timing Thank and you. your voice and how you just like bam, 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 bam. You just have the next one coming and the next one coming. I mean, I was laughing a lot. So are you. So are you. Mm -hmm. Why are you laughing so Good. So funny, so fearless. That's what Simon says. Mm -hmm. Thank you. What about you, Sophia? It was fascinating. Your energy, the way that you control the stage, the, you, you didn't miss one beat. You mm -hmm. know your material. Yep. You mm -hmm. feel like you need to be like on a TV show, actually. Mm -hmm. Yes. yes. You, you have a voice where we can hear you and we can hear your rhythm and we can hear your attitude and we love it and we connect with it. I think people not only are mm -hmm. going to love you, they will imitate. 
imitate you, don't want to see you. You have catchphrases. Yep. You have everything in that arsenal that a, a great comedian needs. You are ready to explode. Yep. I wanted to love you, and I did love you. <laughs> Four women in comedy! Let's vote. I'm going to give you a first yes. You were fantastic. Mm -hmm. Second yes. Sophia, I think people are going to love you. Yep. Yes. Yeah. And I did too. That was great, especially when like uh, the one with the he get the, the joke with the stoner. <laughs> because he, the truth is, it's your mom for the night you never got to make her birth control. <laughs> that was great. All her stuff was great. Uh, the fa my favorite was one of that one. But yes, I would definitely go and if she was in like, let's say Pittsburgh, maybe around that. I would definitely go see stand up her stand up. Yeah, I would. There's other ones I would see too, but her I would definitely go see. She's great. Yeah, she deserved to have her on like call me tour, stuff like that. She's that good. I can't wait to see her in the next round of AGT. So looking forward to the jokes. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> Anyway, if you like my reaction, please like, please comment, and also please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Thank all my subscribers for subscribing, liking, commenting, sharing, and viewing. Without you, I won't be doing these. So thank you, everybody. Hope you had a safe and wonderful Friday, and I'll see you next time. Take care, stay safe, stay humble, and be a blessing.